Hi guys, so see how we're all doing this week. So I decided to, instead of doing another video for you guys this week, and I'm feeling now I may have another video I've got to do, but checking through my little notes. Actually, no, that'll, that'll be next week because I already did a whole vlog last week. But anyways, I wanted to sit down and chat to you guys about a lot of reasons why I really didn't go live last week. On my Instagram and one of them was because I was emotionally drained you know throughout this entire year it has been an emotional roller coaster I've been exhausted ending friendships um, feeling so alone in this battle and that's just how it feels at the moment you know back in June I celebrated um, seven years of being in recovery and did everything that happened with Demi really, really, really screwed up my head. You know, um, one of the things I try to say to myself, and this is an ex exercise that I do on, on myself, I said to myself, no, you're not going to go into this headspace. You've been through this once before. You can get out of it. Go watch something that can make you laugh. Or go have something in the background or something you can listen to that will help you instantly change your mind of thought, you know? With learning with so much of my um, Herbalife um, friends and family, you, you know, um, I learned that it's mind over matter. You know, and um, it's more about... Um, what I want to do, not about what everyone else wants me to do, you know. And um, especially with all the head screws around my job network, trying to get into a, a proper job network with hopefully within days I can change, which would be great. Um, not having to deal with people who really do not understand what you go through. And it's been like this for a year, you know. And I try to tell you guys that... Um, I'm always growing, I'm always learning, and I'm always staying strong, which is the most truest thing that I have been doing. Well, not for all of this year, because sometimes I have to censor myself, you know, and I don't like to do that. I like just to tell it how it is, but in some cases, I just tell myself, you know what, there's people out there who are just going to waste your time, and I'm telling you all who are either younger or older than me that there's going to be people out there who are going to use you. And unfortunately, we have to learn that lesson. And for over this past, you know, four years with a friend that I tried to, to talk him out of suicide, it was emotionally draining for me. And I'm sort of glad that that friendship's done. I'm kind of glad, you know, I knew that it was finished when I went to my friend's birthday party, that it was completely done. And I can be general, I can say, hey, how you doing? Blah, 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 you know, and it's like, it's just done. And you know what? That's okay. You know, I sometimes for other people, it takes longer to realize a lot about change. And I always welcome change, and sometimes it's very incredibly scary. But it depends on your mindset. So the biggest reason why I didn't go live was because I didn't want to. I didn't want to. I don't want to force myself to do something that I didn't want to do. And plus, um, and in about probably nearly almost two weeks or so, which is one, two, three, four, five days. And about a week, well, five days, and hang on, let me recount that. So five days, um, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, about eleven days, which will be the end of this month. I'm just going to go live for you guys. And I will go live again at 3 p.m., which will be Sunday the 28th. i put that down in the comments below for you guys. And, yeah. Because I wanted to catch up on last month's life, but I really wasn't well. And I just decided, you know what, screw it. That's just how it is, you know. And you all know I go through a lot. I, I really look down because that's how I've been feeling for this past weekend, you know. But, um... Hmm. But I'll be okay. You know what? That's okay. You know, I can go back 
watching a ton of NCIS, which actually helped me make me feel better last week because the humor in it I just love. And um, I can always go listen to a podcast, which I was listening to yesterday, and play some video games. So one of the two things I definitely will be doing. But um, I want you all to know that I am okay. That is the most positive thing, you know. Even though there's times when I'm not okay, but I recognize that feeling, you know. And to feel these feelings and to feel these feelings of pain, sometimes we need to be able to feel that to get past it. And I know people are probably thinking, hmm, that's really fucking hard to do. Yeah, it is fucking hard to do because I've been working my ass off for seven years to get to where I am here today. But anyway, guys, I'm going to head off. I'm going to go do my own thing today. But I hope you all are okay. I really do mean that. And I'm am sorry. I am really am sorry that I missed last week's live. I just didn't want to. And that's okay too. But remember, guys, you can check me out on all my social medias. All the links are down below. Especially with my website as well. Um, mostly I'm active on Facebook and Instagram more on Instagram than anything and then go down more below where you can go check out all my social media links thank you all so much for joining me for this video I'll catch you all maybe for a um fitness journey talk maybe maybe not but I hope you're all okay and please be kind to one another now I will see you Sunday or I'll see you all next week